Let's rock, baby. Look, look, it's the cool Dante over on the left. You see him? Do you oh, see him? Oh, it's the good one. You see him? It's the good one. That Dante's fucking dead. It's... Dead to the world. I want to see this headshotted is... scissor fuckers. Yeah. Well, that's one you get for free. And I want to see Phantom's fucking fireball... Hit back at him. Hit back at him. Point blank. Are we going to actually pretend people don't Two know... Yeah, a lot of people don't. What Devil May Cry is? A lot of people don't. And the other. The underworld. Somebody from the underworld. <laughs> Somebody from the underworld. Just woke up to justice! Yeah. I always love that line. It's very Japanese translated, but it's still great. The bug man Sparta doing his kata kicks. Look at him go. I'm gonna cut you. Did you think he was a bug man? Weirdly enough, possibly Bayonetta's uncle. What? Legendary Dark Knight. Don't worry about that. I can't seem to get any real business. Yeah. Hello. Where'd you get the motorcycle? Ah, sword. <laughs> Time to go to work, guys. Now, let's look at what happened. He knows he stopped it with devil energy. He did. Boy, I wish he had ever used that power <laughs> ever again, ever. I, they might have been Even going for slow mo. Happened. That was like yeah, cool mo. What's drinks? Uh, the piano in the background. Is might as well have come out of like RE2 or RE3. Yeah, yeah, same sound. The set, the total soundscape is actually really, really similar. I wonder why that is. Oh my god, I almost forgot about the plane. Oh yeah, almost. How could you? Okay, let's start this out with Devil May Cry's thesis statement. Yes, which is Dante can be cool. Action heroes can be cool, stylish, without smoking. Come drinking on, let's go. or swearing. That's right. They can be cool without being edgy. And that's basically what the entire thing is built off of. Stylistically, at least. The history lesson is, back in the 90s, they wanted to have a more action-oriented Resident Evil game. Mm -hmm. And so they made Resident Evil 4, which I'm going to call Resident Evil 4 Part 1. Mm -hmm. Which ended up being a massive disaster because it was too weird to be Resident Evil. So they turned it into this. Hey, Wooly, when you saw Leon in RE4, what part of his look was the thing that stood out the most to you? Was it his cool fucking jacket? <laughs> it's almost like yeah, yeah, yeah. at some point they discovered, what if we just gave our characters cool fucking jackets? Would that make them cool? Everyone likes a cool jacket. And the answer is yes. So much like a, a Resident Evil game. By the way, Willie, I tricked you into doing a Resident Evil game. Um, hey! No, no, no! God forbid! Um, uh, oh no! You need some bullshit to, to open this! Yeah. Yeah. Some bullshit! First time I ever saw this game. I actually saw it before it came out because GameSpot actually had video of it. They had like a minute of video of it on their E3 website give that year. Little, give us a little high five. And what ended up happening? Oh, well, we did get a high to up. Oh. There we go. Uh, what ended up happening is they called it Capcom's answer to Castlevania. <laughs> and will this be able to compete with like any upcoming Konami 3D Castlevania? <laughs> um, that is. And fucking hilarious. what a fucking in retrospect. time capsule that oh, idea wow. is. Wow. There's a sculpture of a female in agony with a sword pierced through her chest. When I can hear a voice. I am Alastor. The weak shall give their heart and swear their eternal loyalty to me. I will show up in beautiful Joe. And it'll be rad. Yeah, this is the moment. This is the iconic cutscene right I, here. I completely, like, this is where the game just lost me. Yeah? Because I'm like, why would you do it in this weird way? Like, I understand that he can survive getting stabbed, right? Yeah. But why would you go this way where you have to go through the fucking handle and The hit? big handle! It's really big! That's the hardest, most ugly way to do this! Why would you do that? Now it's in your neck! Oh, it's everywhere! It's through his head oh, now! No. It came out the back of your head! Because I'm so tough! It's not a samurai sword, it's a gigantic blade, and I guess you're baptized in it now. 
But the hilt is huge! So we have the Force Edge, and the Force Edge is fine. And in fact, the Force Edge will later go on to be more than fine. Yeah, it'll be the best. <laughs> it'll be the fucking sick. But for the vast majority of Double May Cry 1, Alistair is the shit. Force Edge, Rebellion, uh, uh, Alistair. I like, uh, I like the Force Edge, but in the offhand. The correct answer is Yamato. That's a that's a, <laughs> I knew you were gonna do that, but I wasn't gonna play along anyway. So the the shotgun has a really long firing animation. And has that cool ch ch yep. on the reload. But if you I don't know, sidestep, you can just do this instead. Which makes the shotgun way better. Unfortunately, that leaves the pistols in the fucking dirt after all the other weapons, which are two of them. Grim Reaper, like, but you're not really gonna be taking pot shots. On no, you're gonna be using them for joke. Un huh. Until a certain rocket. Should we launcher. get that uh, key? It's just a rusty key. Until a certain rocket launcher shows up. Yes. Um, well, let's yeah. get out of here. I'm sure we have we've done everything in this room. Let's just leave. Yeah. The other thing I was gonna say about air raid, like, if like you don't realize how little time you have. Wait, were they not supposed to attack me yet? Luckily, this time I completely done everything in this room. Okay, there we go. Ah, uh, evil witch dot wav dot wave. So these these guys are back in five. Yes. After being very missed for a long time. The Sin Scissors. Going from, like, oh, these are an annoying enemy to fight, to single-handedly fucking like that. seeing the lineup is like, oh, these are the best enemies in, in any video game ever. Yeah, they're like, great. These are just the best enemies ever. For years, I thought that that was only possible with the shotgun because of the spread. That's what I was taught. Guess what? It's absolutely possible with the pistol. Just do that. One, two. Ah, oh. no. it's finickier but, though. See, but but like to, to illustrate the point. Of there. It, yeah. I don't really care for a round trip either that much. No. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and just grab one blue orb. Okay. Yeah. So the orbs you want to get are the ones that increase your permanent permanent abilities. Yes. Yeah. Blue, purple, not gold. Fuck you. Fuck you, gold <laughs> orb. It's tempting when you suck. I will attempt to get through this game without using one gold. It attempts- it, it's tempting when you suck. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, yeah, again. Oh, my health is draining! Yeah. No! Another moment. Oh god, I forgot these enemies existed. They're just skeletons. Look at it. For real. All right, let's get back and no. Mm -hmm. Fuck. There you go. Oh. Hey, listen. Like, this yeah. is not an LP of people that are ex that are experts or big goods at Devil May Cry. In fact, this is an LP of people that love Devil May Cry. Yeah, I was gonna say, don't even say that we know it. I know it. Okay. But I mean, like, we have some factoids. Fuck yeah. Have... Ah! 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 Alright, boy. First encounter. I love Phantom. Now, I remember this being hard as shit, by the way. Yeah. So, you know. Don't expose your balls. Disappointing catch. For your sake, you got something inside that. Starting the trend of the most typical and predictable of demons being the first in the game. Ah, I'm a demon! The most demon looking demon you can get shows up right away just to establish what your character's rocking with. So, you're. It's. I wouldn't say it's hard as shit, but considering this was a, essentially a new genre at the time. This fight was a rude fucking awakening. For what the game was going to be. Yeah. Yeah, yeah absolutely. So uh, the fun part the about DT is you don't have any hit stun of any kind whatsoever. Yeah. Letting you just fucking dunk yeah, on yeah, these yeah, guys. Yeah, yeah. There you go. <laughs> Alright, so we have a lot of things we can do right now. We can go this way, and we can do the Pride of the Lion. Or it's the we can fight Phantom again. 
So, fun fact, this is the best farming spot in the game for red orbs. Uh, but it requires, like, nerves of steel. Because you need to fucking beat Phantom beat him, here. Beat him here. Which isn't that bad. Especially since your oh, shit oh, oh. actually it has, time. has active frames and you can mm -hmm. reflect it into him even when he's doing it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So you basically just do that over and over and over and over and that'll let you buy all the, all the stinger upgrades and all that stuff. Yeah, check out your mom's ass. Look at it. See it? Yeah. Yeah, that's what Dante's about. Don't you love it when your hero stares at his mom's ass? Like, the game tells you right the game away. tells you, yo, that's his mom. Immediately. Yo, he's... And, yeah. you, and for a second... Yo, he's hot for that. But at first, se you looking at it, though, in the beginning, you might look at it and think, oh, that's his own girlfriend, you know? Or like, oh, that's, that's his ex. That's his ex or some shit. Yeah, like, you might assume. But no. That's how annoying that shit is, by the way. It's very annoying. It's as creepy as it appears to be. What's up with Japanese-looking... Shut up. Sigils Shut in up. this gothic Christian household of a church mansion. All right. <laughs> yep. Yep. Yeah. And yeah. This one is tough. And this was before uh, DTing would heal you a little bit, right? <sighs> ah! don't have the ability to choose no. no. I will attempt to get through this game without using one goal. So let's try with the pistols. Because that's always another thing too is like, you're like, as you're getting desperate, pop it because you might get- Oh control. great! It's one of those fucking secret missions. The ones that disappear on failure. Hey, look. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> what? What is that? Hey. What the fuck is that? This is the moment you knew. Hey, this, look. This game was the dopest. The dopest shit. Hey, look, it's Macbeth. <laughs> from my friend's Macbeth project, where they just videotaped the, the Nello Angelo fights to recreate Macduff and Macbeth going at <laughs> Actually, this is not the moment. The exact moment? Mm -hmm. is, oh, yeah, it's coming up. It's, it's coming uh, up. Uh, yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. You're like, what do we got here? It's... He's huge. A crazy huge demon design. Uh-huh. This stinking hole was the last place I thought I'd find anyone with some guts. <laughs> Take it outside, fuckboy. Yeah! <laughs> It's so good! Oh my god! It's got the Metal Gear- Oh no! That was cheap! Evil of the Waterways. Defeat the Evil Guardian and acquire the Guiding Light. What could that be? Fuck that guy, something. by the way. Fuck that guy in particular. I don't like him. It's something that can fill Dark Souls. Shut up. That's awful. Don't tell me, tell Dante. I will. I fucking will and you know it. Bugs are your family, Dante. They're I guess they are. They're your fucking family. Bug mods. What about blobs? Yeah. What about blobs? No, he doesn't. He doesn't. Sparta wasn't a blob. Yeah, that's kind of the point, isn't it? I mean, he was a fucking BDSM torture slave. No, you're thinking of you're thinking <laughs> of the, the, the reboot. You're thinking of that shit. In that cutscene, you got to see that one shot. He's the one his... shot. Like, <laughs> Sparta was a normal man. He was a loser. Uh, Fuck that. Like, you show him for one second, and you show him being Jerry from Rick and Morty. Yeah. God. I don't like it. So, yeah. I believe this is before they even gave you the why'd you fuck up. Or penalty. Right? And it's like, because I got penalty from dying twice. Yes. Um, and that whole thing about uh, discouraging you from spending money on consumables and error correction is also something that shows up on the end of the mission that says, oh, you bought an item and spent it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Spending items is bad. Don't. And you're like, oh. Don't, you fucks. But Spent all that time just to get up to here. But items are good things in video games. No! They're for losers! <laughs> and it's uncool to use an item! A cool little thing we got right here. That's cool. No problem. 
Oh yeah, taunting serves its purpose in this game. Uh-oh. It still ex it still extended your combo, did it not? I believe so. Yeah. I'm not sure. So. Oh uh, shit! He's mad because I fucked his arms up. And his babies twice. Damn. All of them. Well, the camera's changing consistently, so. But that was the biggest problem early on was like Resident Evil camera, not super great for things attacking from weird angles. Yep. Sure isn't. And that didn't go away until ever. <laughs> Ever. <laughs> Every single game in the franchise had that problem. Well, not four. Four had the weirdness of running, camera changes, run for two steps, run back the other way because you're holding one direction. Gotcha. Oh, I blew him up with the last hit. Yeah. Eat shit, buddy. Oh, bad cutscene. Oh. More. Bye, Elvis. This one's for you. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. King of bugs. King of bugs, fucker. You're right. I'm his son, Dante. Sweet dreams. Ah, fuck. And there he goes. Just turns into a bunch of shit. Cool. Splorch! Oh my... Mommy Splorch! Yeah, it's like my loins... They hurt. ache for his return. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay! Dante's relationship with Trish Twitch? Is... <laughs> I said Twish at the first part. With Twish... <laughs> is... Is fucked, man. It's fucked. Yeah, she's a hot blonde. Sure. But... She looks identical to your mom, and when we get to that later, we'll discover why. <laughs> Leia, all the time. Leia kissed Luke for good luck. No, she didn't. She kissed Luke to fucking <laughs> nag on fucking Ford. Ford? Ford. Yes. For Harrison. Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. She kissed the character Luke to fuck with Harrison Ford. Correct. Alright, I got the grenade launcher. No other gun Done. exists at this point. End of- end of gun. You ever see that fucking animation somebody did of Postman Pat? You remember Postman Pat, dude? Postman don't? Pat and his fucking white cat. Yeah, so they yeah. just did the same exact intro, but then at the end, the- the letter that he delivers just says snitching. Maybe you can never be sure there'll be luck. Reasons, letters through your door. <laughs> Would Dante, would Dante be the worst or best dad? The worst. The worst ever. He never grew up. But what about his relationship with Nero? He's like... He, <laughs> he's like 65! Yeah. And he's acting like a college dropout. Also, like, Nero, who's had a pretty rough go of it, when Dante just jumps in and doesn't explain anything. He Zero. Gives him no context, fights him. Haha, -ha, you're pretty tough. And then goes, all right, you can hold on to that sword. And then walks away. Or rides away on his motorcycle. Or how about this? Yeah, fight the savior. It's good for your character growth. Right. I could save the city in like a second. He's that old. But, but you know, you should do it. He's that shitty old uncle. Destiny awaits somewhere deep in the Coliseum. There's a Devil Star in there that we're never gonna use. Never, ever, NEVER going to use. Are you sure? I will not use items in this playthrough. I thought. I will never. Might. What Resident fucking Evil what is, is this? Now? These are hunters. Okay, alright. Think about it. Yeah. I actually know what hunters are, yes. But, and, and it, by the way, you know where you first fight your first hunter in Resident Evil? In the courtyard? Yep. Okay. In the, in the path to, from the, from the mansion to the courtyard. Damn. Damn. It's overt, man. <laughs> like, it's, it, it, I am not joking around. What I want to know is this, if it's intentional or unintended. It has to be. It has know? to be. There's so much. But they're just creatures of habit in development. They're fucking lizard monsters. Developers? That's me. No. No. Good one. Good one. Good catch. Good good trap you set for me there. Now, I hope you remember this fun part, where you have to do this fucking platforming challenge in 3D with bad camera angles. 
that they try. They legitimately try to help you with these camera angles. I completely forget this. Deleted huh? this. Yeah. Fuck. You went for the shortcut. I went for the sh well. At least you recognized it instead of going. Ha ha, idiot! You just jumped off. Uh, I'm a huge fan of Agni and Rudra. And, Chat. Uh, yeah. And uh, Nevin. Ifrit. Yeah. And now you can weapon switch. Very slowly. It's almost like they knew no one would ever want to switch out of the fucking uh, thing. So let's take this but, first spin. Well, at least you don't have to pause the game. Mmm. 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 Oh, feels so good. Big charge for big boys. Lock off, Featherface, or you can stick around and find out the hard way. Yeah. It's the best. It's the best. So, like... In that, it's the worst, of course. But yeah. it comes back and fucking Bayo says it. Yeah. It's, it's a cool thing to say to bird monsters. Oh, no, it's a fetish. I think that's what they're calling it. Fetish? And they're, they're fire-powered, because now I have a fire-power. Everybody got the fire-power. Fetishes do not appear on easy difficulty. Nope. I did not know that. So, in fact, time to come clean, Wooly. Back in the day, I wasn't very good at character action games. And when I died about a hundred times to Phantom, and the game, which is now laughable, right? Mm. The game was like, would you like to play on Easy Auto? Mm -hmm. I went, yeah, sure. And I beat the game on Easy Auto. And that was the first time I ever beat DMC. And then you had a discussion with someone about something. Nope. Okay. And then I went, wow, that game's amazing. I would like to play it on normal. So that cutscene freaked me the fuck out uh, because it's not in easy mode. Yeah. I went, oh my god, how much other stuff yeah, is, did I okay, miss? Okay. And the answer is not that much. The frosts aren't there either. The two frosts, mm -hmm. I don't believe they attack you either. Yeah, you had a plan. I wonder if there was a build of this game that had locking in it. That would have been awful. I wonder. That would have been awful. I wonder if there's a... No, no, you know what? I bet you there's a build of Devil May Cry 2 that has blocking in it. I bet there is. Kids like the block By fan request. Oh, they love it. Ugh. The start of Bloodborne was uh, a solid, like, long session, probably like three and a half. It was way longer. It was closer to like six. It was a huge we, day. Bloodborne, I think, is like the most excited we have ever been to start an LP. And, and uh, that was dumb. Yeah. <laughs> well, well, I mean, here's the thing, right? New crazy switching Souls game, but it's in fucking, like, a completely different time, you know, and everything. Like, it was great. But the excitement was there, and, and, and it taught me something, which is that was when that was probably the first time I can recall where um, the new the new excitement thing, like immediately being followed, like as it goes, like we walked away going, yeah, that was the one of the best sessions we've ever recorded. That was great. Oh, so if you so want to go back in time, I even remember where we stopped. We stopped at uh, fucking Bloodstar. Bloodstar. Yeah. 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 And, and we were like, oh, we don't have it within us to fucking do this today after, like, six and a half hours of recording. But man, whoa, so what much. a sesh. <laughs> <laughs> now we will watch the enemy step tutorial for Devil May Cry 1 and how you can get infinite killer bees. I'm staring at my phone and I'm not looking it up. Don't do it. What do you mean you're looking at your phone? Oh, yeah, it's a sign of chastity. A brain. Nice. I don't know what that means. It means. Well, that let's think about that for a second. Yeah. It means you should. You're use, smart enough to use your head to, to save it for marriage. Yup. Just say no. Man, those those nightmares about saving it for marriage freak me out, man. Just use your brain and say, "Be gone, bot." Oh yeah, that's right. You told your mom you saved it for marriage, right? Now you're getting married. <laughs> good, good, Jesus. You know, I wish I could fucking translate the look on his goddamn face to you people right now. Because it's it's something. Because do you, do you, okay, let me. You want me to walk you through what just happened? <laughs> I was I was like, I have a story, and then I was like, no, nope, no, nope. I don't. And then I felt that, so I said, <laughs> hey, how would your mom feel about that? Because I fucking feel it from across the room. 
and I'm like, I'm gonna just pull this out. Just pull it out of you. Make it too awkward there for is, you to not there say is something. No story. <laughs> None. Fuck you. Just wow. Oh, where was it? Which game started the gunshots? Which one? The stage clear gunshots. Was it two? Was it two? Oh, that one was easy. It might have been two. Wait, I'm sorry. What two? There's no such thing. Silly me. Silly. You say that, but the person editing this has words. So the funniest part about uh, that... The, cor the correction? So we, we sat down and recorded the final episode of Banner Saga right before doing this for you guys. Sure did. And uh, we died a couple times in that. So we sent it off to Billy and said, hey, cut here, because we had some trouble. And uh, then I said, hey, we're recording Devil May Cry 1 today, so if you could make a title card and stuff like that. And he said, oh, it's great. He goes, you're starting Devil May Cry 1, my favorite Devil May Cry game. Like, very clear. Could you imagine, like... <laughs> Standing in front of a podium. Could you fucking imagine, like, something like Itagaki and Cory Barlog both came out and were like, yeah, our favorite DMCs too. And you're just like, and the and the and the gameplay designer of Darksiders, and yeah, you know, yeah, and yeah, so yeah, on yeah, and so yeah, forth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you're just like, oh boy. It's like, should I stop enjoying your games? Yeah. I daydream quite often about the game that hates the, its own audience. <laughs> like, I don't want it, right? Oh fuck! This game hates you right now. Oh, this is the weirdest part. Why did they make it like this? Remember when they went back to this mode and they put this back in the other games? I want to point out that this that control is inverted, <laughs> as well. Remember, it's not just like, oh. Remember when that great idea got brought back? It's kind of nutty because no. you know the way that stuff happens, and we like we talk about it these days because it's such a. It's such an, uh, a quintessential bit of almost every classic PS2 thing, but it's like, there's someone on the dev team that's kind of like, Hey, I've been working on something different. Something fresh. A, a unique experience. I have a cool idea, you guys. You know, and like, it would be really not hard to make. In fact, we've already got it going. The controls already work in our engine. Yeah, really? And it's just like, do you want to switch the game style up completely? Because variety is good and fun to play. Variety players. is good and fun to do. And drop a completely different genre on people. Glad you could smash these. Which though. a lot of the times is a great idea. A very good idea. Very fun to play. <sighs> oh no! So, it's the worst part of the DMC one. At some point between the last session this and this makes one, sense. I fucking went and uh, actually, oh fuck, saw the. Because remember we talked about how Dante's a cool hero who doesn't smoke. Doesn't smoke and doesn't drink and doesn't uh, right. do anything. He doesn't swear. Yeah, so like, yeah. in the design documents for the new Dante in the remake. Uh, sorry, 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 the reboot by Ninja Theory. Yes. Uh, I got uh, there's, there's, I it floats this. around the design uh, elements of like, Dante, not this. Dante is this. Yeah, I remember that. And yeah, like, yeah, yeah, some yeah. of them are so outrageously fucking edgelordy and stupid. It's the most off base and most out of touch you it's, can be. It's like Dante is not this, and it shows, I think one of them is Kamen Rider. <laughs> and it goes, Dante is this, and it shows like, uh, what appears to be a meth addict in a hoodie smoking a cigarette. But I think it's a band man. Like, like, you know, from a music band. Yeah. Uh, and it's, and I'm just like, fuck. That is, you're not just reinventing the character, you're making the character into the opposite of, of what, what they are supposed to, to be. be. Um, I really want to find that thing. Yeah, so that was the one, that was the one that fucking had, uh, not this, and then it shows Dante in his, um, it with his, with, uh, fucking, uh, 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 uh what should we call it? Next, he's edited into, uh, Brokeback Mountain. Oh, God, yeah, I forgot! It was also, like, vaguely homophobic! Where they fucking put Dante... We're hanging out with the gay cowboys! And they're like, oh, look at this broke back shit. Like, straight Dante's up. red coat, man, that's for homos! We gotta get a cool Dante, and it's like, And fuck. the cool Dante's western <laughs> and stylish, and then they show you, um... 
Uh, a uh, drunk addict. They show no, 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 no. They show you uh, Tyler Durden. Oh, with the, with the cigarette hanging out of his mouth. And it's 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 fucking. And they're like, the Dante we're making is the Tyler Durden, right? In that one shot, that hyper masculine, right? Dude. Where he's got the cigarette hanging out of his mouth and he's got his shirt mm. off. And like they're like, that's what we're doing. And it's like not broke back. Did that come out before the fucking game? This was leaked. This was leaked afterwards. After, cause like. Fuck, that's the last thing they could have used, right? <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> you, can, you go back and you fix the gameplay, but some of those design cues and, like, the aggressiveness with which they defended them yeah. was uh, really, really hilarious now, looking back at it. And it's it's this thing, it's like, to me, we can all see that you made the character look like you. We, we can see it. It's really clear. I'm not sure why you've tried to downplay that. You know, DMC 1, DMC 2, and... Uh, sorry. DMC 1, 3, and 4 all follow the exact same uh, path of... Uh, what do you call it? Of story seriousness. Mm -hmm. A little bit serious at the beginning. Just a little bit. Very not serious. Aggressively unserious for 99% of the game. Then a little bit serious. Then again. getting a little bit serious. A little bit serious again. Oh no, we actually have to fight the guy. But also, the second time they try to be serious, it's awful, and it's, therefore the best. It's very awful. Very it's awful. filling your dark soul with light. It's curie. It's uh. Well, you don't. You don't like curie. It's devils never cry. <laughs> I remember. Right. I remember when um. When I was fighting the final Virgil fight uh, in TMC3, and there is another terrible soul line in that. It's so we should we may share the same blood, but we also share his soul. And right now, my soul is saying to stab you. <laughs> right, <laughs> that one. Like my sister just passed through the room. Oh no! And was like, oh, no. and was like, what the fuck? And you're like, shut up! Shut up! It's cool! It's cool. <laughs> Cause it, she doesn't know that you're fucking 20 hours in! Get out, no! <laughs> when you're taking on, um... Uh, 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 when you're taking on... God, what's a Sanctus? Right before the Savior is coming and yeah. all that, he just, and he keeps shouting it out and whatever. And when you finally work your way in, and land that grab, and he just goes, I'm sick and tired of your bullshit! He hits him, and we're like, yeah! Yeah, 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 yeah! I'm really sick, shut up, shut up, Dad! Shut up, Mom! <laughs> I'll get you, I'm in to listen to my music! So sick of your bullshit, I'm in my room! <laughs> I got my double arm, yeah, I, I know how it got like that, it's gross! <laughs> shut up! Yeah, I'm gonna save my girlfriend! You don't, I know you don't like her, it's fucking... Shut up! And her stupid snobby brother is always getting in the way and saying we can't hang out. Fuck that guy. I'm cool. She likes me. For me. We're gonna run away and start a band. <laughs> <laughs> and it's gonna be called Devils Never Cry. <laughs> Why is Auntie Trish in blackface? <laughs> yeah, you can lame this if you want to lame it. Hell yeah, I'm gonna lame it. You know what's lamer than lame? Dead. Being lit. Oh, fuck. Yeah. You do all sorts of lame shit look in this at, house. Wow, look at your dull. <laughs> no! Oh. God! Da, da, da. Oh. oh my god, magic picture! <laughs> Is there anything below D? No. No. But you're gonna discover right now. The game's gonna fucking shut itself down. That was the worst it's ever been. That Whatever. was the, like that was the antithesis of style. Oh no! Don't kill the noble enemy. Oh, uh, you know what? I never really put it together that his energy blasts are the exact same color and effect as Trish's. Uh, Trish has yellow energy. She does? Yes, you're super wrong. Oh, I am super wrong. Why am I thinking that she has blue energy or I don't purple know. energy? But 
purple energy comes off of Dante when he uses. I'm sure it happened once, and thus I'm okay. Yeah, Trish is a thousand. Is shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> shut up! Shut up! C's not so bad. Uh, C could be worse. It could be D. Think about it. Oh man, it was so late. Like for that, like no honor battle to happen on like the fucking lamest way to do it. You're on the you're on the magic pixel though, so we can technically just in any other game that's like oh that was so good it was so close. Here it's like oh you loser. <laughs> oh. In any game fucking, that's not Devil May Cry, fucking that would have if this loser. was Dev, if this was Dark Souls we'd be like oh. Oh shit, yeah! What a fucking loser, holy shit. You know, shit. like dar all those Dark Souls battles where we were on one fucking hit from dying, it's the hypest it's ever been. But now, fuck you. <laughs> that shit was ass. You suck. I really dislike the ending of DMC4 being written that Dante could have solved it in like a second. If you just went. But it's Nero's battle if he got if he grabbed the Yamato and it's like from the beginning of the yeah, game yeah <laughs> but it's like there's a giant monster stomping around a city presumably killing people Dante isn't this important to deal with nah I was so bored when I saw this enemy I was like oh who cares right oh it's an electric bat just kind of like the fire bats I was fighting with Griffin right uh huh I was like boo oh, okay it's a man okay it's a cyclops man okay <laughs> That's fine, but then... Fall down, please. I would appreciate it if you fall down. That's not what I want. Yeah, there, there is a lot You're ruining going. my fucking... You're ruining my goddamn thing but here. It's not his fault. He's stuck on the statue. He's trying. Oh, he's, he's slightly too high. But... Come on, man. I never quite thought Come about on, it man. this way. This is going really badly. Oh, man. For cool, not for him. Or me, even. Your presentation, your TED talk is fucking killing it right now. I know. Everybody. Oh my god. You killed him. Okay, so those guys... <laughs> are, ...are clones, and they share your moveset, and they would later go on to become the joy in Bayonetta. But not if but you kill not them if... before they turn into that form. You did it. That's awful. TED talk over. Alright, fuck it, let's do it. There's a strong surge of evil coming from the puddle of water. There's a voice in my head saying something. One who knocks on the gate to the underworld shall borrow the strength from the blue stone. Huh? But that's not the reflection. The one reborn. Behold, the hardest boss in Devil May Cry 1. Enjoy. But only on the hardest difficulty. <laughs> so this is great. Love it. Damage the fuck out of him. That's a third right there. Let's let him get into goo mode for a second. He should be doing it pretty... There it is. Mm -hmm. The thing that most players will go, FUCK! But decent players will go, yeah. This room is great if you've got a relative mastery of the different enemy types. It is the worst if you don't. And it also... So in DMC1, you fight every boss three times. Why? Because that's cool. But some bosses you can fight... More than three times. Uh, you don't say. Yeah. Hi there, Phantom. However, you're back in. And... Pop! Right. Super worth it. The main issue with Nightmare is that uh, in his second and third phases, he gains moves that are more or less impossible to avoid. Uh, in particular, there's the move he gains in... Th uh, f uh, Nightmare 3, which part of his chest comes off and starts spinning around. And I don't know how the fuck you're supposed to avoid that, genuinely. Um, it's the only fight on DMD that I, I could not get through without using items, period. It's... in my brain it's bo- oh! You start shooting in circles. So apparently there is a secret way, I shit you not, to kill Phantom. There is a secret way to kill Phantom. no, no, no. Um, Phantom. Instant kill. An uh, instant kill in his last phase. So the deal is, is you know that he falls through the floor? Okay. If he does his jump move three times on the glass, he just falls through the floor. Oh, yes! Instant cutscenes. Oh my god, I totally... Yes, I did know that. I did not know that. I knew that, yeah, yeah, yeah. That was, uh... Uh, Shmup got Pat told me about that. That's true, that's true. You can, you can bait him to fall through. What a maroon.
By the way, I should mention, I have not even looked at Nightmare Beta. Um, I should probably fire it once. This is your little preview of Nightmare. So it is a extraordinarily powerful gun. But it eats your DT, so fuck that. That later got reworked into the Artemis. A really fantastic gun, which I fucking can't stand! I can't stand the Artemis, man. Oh boy. Now, if you were playing on easy auto, you would miss out on everything cool about to happen through this portal. Fuck. Fuck. Nailed oh it. my god. Nailing it the hardest it's ever nailed. There's a painting of a Coliseum. I, I must have had to... fuck. Oh my god. You're right. Look at all these cool things. Look at that there. cool shit. Do you, do you subscribe to the system of belief that the sword is actually making those cuts? Or do you think it's just magic spells coming out of the swords? Uh, like, it's, out of the blade? It's the sword. It's magic coming from the blade? No, it's the, he's the cut. sword's cutting. He's cutting. Those lines? Yeah, he's doing a super fast micro cut. He's doing a micro cut in front of him that is making the air sharp where he is pointing it because he's so accurate with his eye shoots. It's dumb weeb trash, man. What do you want from me? Okay, so does that it's not magical? Does that mean that a judgment cut, right, in the flick and then back into the hilt, right, and a big. 360 degree orb of cut. Oh, sorry, I, I messed up the names. Yeah, that was what I was actually talking about. He's cutting the air. So he's. The so that, that sphere is a pocket? Yeah, that sphere is a pocket of sharp blade air. <laughs> what the fuck else is it, man? <laughs> uh oh. I gotta use the bathroom. Oh no. Now? Now of all time? That's fine, I'll, I'll, I'll do this stuff. Wooly's taking a new medicine that makes him poop his pants. I love that I timed that with a drink of your fucking drink so that you, like, <laughs> you fucking... You're, he's mid-sip, and he's like, fuck, I can tell it's in his eye. That feels almost calculated. It wasn't, but I wish it was. I've noticed something in the years that we've been doing Best Friends is that we used to just hold it in for hours. And now we're all in our 30s. And that seems like a really bad idea to do. So we don't do it anymore. Last thing I need is to actually piss my pants, either recorded or on stream. I'm not really sure which one would be worse. Because if I piss my pants recorded, then I could never be certain that Wooly and Matt didn't just convince Billy to just give them a copy of me pissing myself and hold it over me forever. But if it was live, then it would belong to everyone in the world. These are things I think about. Uh, Welcome back. Were you talking about that time you pissed yourself on stream? I did not piss myself on stream. That's not what the subreddit told that, me. The subreddit says... It, okay, alright. Everything the subreddit says is the truth. Start now. <laughs> Wooly. So what happened? I fucking spilled like an entire... Like, I, I grabbed a, a glass of water and just like, mmm, big glass of water, and then just put the entire thing directly out of my lap. Are you sure it wasn't a glass of piss? <laughs> I'm pretty sure it wasn't a glass of piss. A man with guts and honor. I like that. But it's a shame you serve Mundus. I think it's pretty clear that Dante, up until the reveal, does has no goddamn idea Zero. that that's Virgil. Zero. I mean, he the, the, he calls he just calls him. Oh yeah, you're you're a guy, you're a cool guy. The giant blue aura is not cluing him off at all. A lot of people probably have giant blue auras. He's kind of scared by it. Oh! He looks terrible. No. no! Ooh. Ooh. Oh! Ooh. That's damn it. Damn, son! I oh fuck. Claimed. That's the that's the first one. Claimed. That was honest. I was really hoping that I could get through the whole game without dying once to anything but the secret missions. That was honest. And Nello three. I didn't. So, fuck you. You know how at the end of three, in your post credit oh, scene. Oh fuck! Rocked. He's like this party is getting crazy or it's whatever. Get, look at it. 
Look how crazy the party is getting. It's almost like it's dull. No, now it's cool. Healed back enough to still not take one hit. Yep. Okay. You might turn this around. Yep, I got it. Ooh. Hey! But it's a soul. It's not a Souls game, so once again, that's embarrassing. <laughs> oh, I'm a monster. Oh, I'm so lame in this game. It sucks. They fixed it. They fixed it later. I'm gonna go see you in three or four games, Dante. He looks way cooler later. It's okay. Okay. Mark. Mark. Well, we leave that behind, though. Back to so, hell. So, because... But he went to hell and he dro But here's the question. He dropped, like, the Yamato before he went to hell? But then in hell, when he's running towards Mundus, he's got it in his hand. So, what the fuck? Dante. Happy birthday. Wow. So, like... Let's... Let's... Let everyone who's beaten DMC3, or knows this story there, like, that moment is not given nearly the significance it should, knowing the later events that led up to those pendants. Not to mention the fact that you have to think that ten years from that happy memory, yes, they're trying to kill each other in the rain. Yeah. Shirtless. Yeah. And it's all like... They're not shirtless. In Dante, the intro? They, they are not shirtless. Why, why is in your memory are they shirtless? I guess he's just shirtless in his shop. <laughs> yeah. They never fought each other shirtless. In the rain! They are not... Wooly. Hold on. Wooly, I know you think that I'm super wrong no, about I'm, stuff. I, no, I'm, I know I'm probably super wrong right now. They are. But I need to confirm what my brain is telling me, where they don't they don't fight in the, shirtless in the intro in the rain, and then Hell no. wipes his hair off. Like, my brain is going, what? Keep pro progress, go! Yeah, you're right, they're super not shirtless. Well, I, I, <laughs> they're like, they're totally wearing their colors. That was, it's, that, that was, that was nonsense. <laughs> I just double-checked, and in fact, we cannot, we straight up cannot get an orb fragment because I don't have air raid. Just, it is actually impossible. <laughs> Fucking... <clears throat> well, yeah, in fact, the next two require air raid and air hike to acquire because they're so high up. Someone should have spent their money better. Somebody should. Sh sh well, you know what? You know what? You, sh you, you know what? You should have bought it. Orbs are of no use here. That's a cool little detail, actually. Only in the mirror world. Fuck. Well, luckily, there's an orb of time fucks or whatever over here. Is somebody about to buy air raid? But only. Oh, it's only the one, huh? I thought it was two purchases. Okay, maybe we'll take air raid out of the trash, but only to go dumpster diving for blue orbs. Like jumping off the, the the front of that wall, you actually got higher than the platform, so you could actually probably air raid back. See, if you transformed and then flew backwards, not that way, but only when you it's only when you jump directly off the same surface. Oh, uh, this one. And you then you jumped backwards. And then you were yeah, but you cannot air raid. Uh, you can't. Oh yeah, you don't. Yeah. You'd fly backwards. Unfortunately, you have nothing. Oh. Oh. Yeah, uh, that's right. Items. There's a devil star in there that we're never gonna use. Got one. Bam. You can even show people the lightning strike. Oh, fuck. Do. I super, uh... Alright. Use another one. Use another I hate one. You. I hate everything. Devil Star. That's an item. I will not use items in this playthrough. You spent. You're using an item and you're. <laughs> oh my god. And you're, and you're using the move that you fucking didn't want to get, and it's just great. It's great. Get in there. Get in there. God damn it. Okay. This one apparently you can actually do. Yeah. What the fuck? What were you not doing? I was not... So you can't grab onto the front, I guess. You can only grab onto the side. Because you see how the side has a slightly longer Jesus. straight line? Jesus Christ. Thanks, video games. Alright, well, the, the my ranking for this mission is just... It doesn't count. It was for the orbs. Uh-huh. 
It was for the orbs. Yeah, I'm sure the ranking will affect, will uh, take that into consideration. He's got all the ingredients of, of like, Christian kids would love it, because... He wholesome. He's cool without doing... And he loves his mom. Nope. nope. No peer pressure. Just effortlessly cool. Loves pizza. Doesn't believe in peer pressure. Dante would come up to you if the other kids in school were telling you to smoke drugs and go, Man, give me that. But then he jumps in a church window and he kills everybody. Oh. <laughs> then he breaks the statue and runs away. Oh no, I just fell into the netherworld. No. So maybe that wouldn't be the greatest thing for the church kids. Because lit Dante literally walks into a church and murders everyone in cold blood, or what appears to be. This must be the gate to the underworld. Exciting. Shall I use it? This is the gate to a franchise that never should have existed. Oh. Well, could you do me a, a small favor and actually look up how to get that secret mission with the bangle? Oh, I was hoping you'd ask that I never reference Underworld on the channel again. Underworld? What? I didn't even... Un I didn't even realize what was happening. It's too late. Kate Beckinsale? That first movie's okay, I guess. Oh, no, no, it wasn't. Yeah. No, no, no. And it looked cool. No, it wasn't. It no, cool, you walked out of that hating it. N did I? Yep. But it was. Uh, no. The trailer was cool. Everybody stares at the new weird half vampire, half werewolf creature. And, oh right now, yeah, it's coming back to and me then now. And they see it. Oh boy. Standing there awkwardly. Oh, and he looks bad. They just walk away. Oh, Everyone just quietly walks away. Oh man. Hey, which side is the army coming from? I have all sides. Uh, switch angles, camera. What? Trish, stay back. Yeah, She's I'll behind. Do, I'll. I'll I'll do that. She's behind an impenetrable thing, though. It's you fine. Moron. What a maroon. Like, I really had a choice. Man, you gotta love the, the hero motivation that comes from, like, oh man, that bad guy, like, he beat up his own villains that were trying to kill me, and that makes me even more mad. I hate, oh, ooh, how could you turn on your own people like that? Don't you have any honor, big evil man? You fool! You're so easy. Oh, I got lured in by your hot mom looks. You? <laughs> Humans, what sweets. You should know better than to trust a stranger. Your presence has become a hindrance to my master's bloody scheme. But now you die. You brought him here. Are, am I still gonna get paid? And which I am having trouble hitting for some reason. It's, it's basically Yami from Okami. Fucking, oh my god. Wow, swing. Swing first. Swing first, Doctor. There we go. Got it. High fives to me. Now, Mommy, why would you do that? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man! No, 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 you can't! No, me! I can see mommy! Dante! <laughs> Dante, why did you save my life? From rubble that I could have kicked. Because I showed the power to lift a motorcycle at the beginning of the game. Because you look like my mother. Get out of my sight. The next time we meet, it won't be like this. Her name was Martha, too. Oh fuck! Dante, this Don't music's come any closer, you devil. <laughs> you may look like my mother, but you're nowhere close to her. You have no soul. You have the face, but you'll never have her fire. <laughs> oh man! <laughs> What's crazy to me is that, like Reuben Langdon. Is the same voice actor in all the games, sure. and it's it that if it's that if it's sure like that, is. it can only come down to writing and direction, it right? Is. Yeah. He didn't just be no. shit for this one. My mother never zapped me in the back with electricity. Well, no. While I was fighting a boss. That was not cool, mommy. It's right. 
the effect on that lava is awful. Is, oh, wow. It did not look like that. It was not meant to be, you know, when you were running by and moving the camera with it at the Holy same time. Holy The textures hate it. Now we know exactly how they're making it move. They're just scrolling the same texture sideways. Oh, that's awful. And it doesn't flow like lava at all, and it looks really bad as you walk alongside the flow. Uh -uh. You did a good job. But not in not in not in current resolution. Oh, guess what saved your life, idiot? Four thousand red orbs. That's Eat right. Shit. Bangle of time. Eat it's shit. a mysterious wristband that has the power to stop time. Clear. Defeated the final secret mission in the game. Still staring at your mom's ass. I believe I got everything but two secret missions. You're basically Joseph Joestar if you yeah. think about it. So, gonna do a little, little thing with the- The reward for the secret mission is, is peeking at mom's butt. Ugh. Mysterious bangle. Peeking through that. So if you wear this bangle. Okay, well. I'm not, I'm not engaging with this. <laughs> and then you hit the L1. <laughs> Neither did Lisa Lisa. The only times I can think of is the alternate costumes for Jill in Resident Evil 3. There is a Dino Crisis. Oh, Holy uh, shit! Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. I don't care. It's my mommy. Trish. Why would I care? Wow, she's clearly not actually shackled in. Like, look. Look at her. You Ow! Why were you pretending to be asleep? Why are you pretending to be dead? God damn it, Trish. You're so stupid. So stupid, I love you. Remind me of my mom. I hate that I love you. Uh, God, I forgot the cuts in this scene are really abrupt. Now there's an unfortunate- So she agreed to go with the plan up until- You're gonna keep zapping, Pat! Uh, until I die. <laughs> that is a very bizarre line. Yeah, yeah. This is the start of, for some reason, Kamiya or whoever the fuck is in charge of the shit, just going, let's let's take a really cool boss fight and shove a really badly placed afterburner game in it. Who loves Afterburner? We everyone do. everyone loves Afterburner, but it doesn't work here because the point that I'm trying to fire at is 100% obscured by my own character if I'm locked on in the right spot. And he's going down in a second. Ooh. There we go. Mundus Form 2. Done. Oh, man. Oh, I can't believe it. Mundus. More like Moon doesn't. I remember being that and feeling like it That's was, good. That's it was fair. genuinely kind of anticlimactic. Fair. Right? It's like the the space battle's cool, but terrible. No. And then the that battle's fine, but Pat. it involves a lot more Pat. platforming. Pat. Oh, trust me. Let's not pretend. Trust. Oh, trust me. Let's not pretend. Let's not mince words. The entire end of this game is awful. <laughs> it's, no, shh. There's one. There's two good parts. There's two good parts. Don't fucking. Or, wait, no, no, shh. Don't you ruin this good part. And now you, too. What were you supposed to do? No, shh. Sh you had one job. I should have saved you. But... No, shut up! I should have been the one to fill your dark soul with light! Light! So there's supposed to be a huge, like, screen annihilating blur on the screen that makes it even more dramatic, but the HD collection doesn't have it for whatever reason. See, for me, it's never about the line, it's about the echo after the line. <laughs> oh no, Dante! This was my mother's. What would Virgil think if he saw you crying, Dante? What would he say, huh? Give me more cries. I need more power of cry. I don't know. Pussiness, Dante. Pussiness. 
<laughs> no, Nero, how could you? Oh, no, Nero, fuck. I'm getting them all confused now. He'd probably lick up the tears to get motivated. Well, almost done this sequence. And then we'll be home free. Oh, no! JPEG. They're your friends. Yeah. See, this I love. Fuck you. Oh, man, those textures. I love that, like, you break him apart and he's like this horrible eyeball goo monster. Yeah, this really is just what Veo spends all of her time killing. All day. What? Oh, she lived for no reason. The fact that Dante's the kind of fucker that says mother. M mo mother. Like, just thinking about the future Dante we know. Jackpot. Uh... And she sets him up with the line, too. Yeah. In the past. No, yeah, just the fucking fact. It's like the cool Goodbye. guy you know and love. You do come my mother! Back, mother! My mother! mother my son, oh. It's the most anime <laughs> shit ever. So, what kind of hug is this? Is this a. Is Mommy this Daddy a, hug? Or is it. Devils never cry. You liar! You fucking cry right He's now! <laughs> And like transplanted this with Dante Del May Cry 5 face of like, yeah, motorcycle! Yeah, yeah I'm so cool, I'm fucking awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, yeah. Virgil's the one that sounds like he's going, hey, mother, but in his head he's like, yeah, let's do this. No, I can't smile. Don't let him see me like it. I hate it. Shut up. Oh, jackpot! Oh, did I say it? Oh, it's oh, 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 I said it! Oh, and he's caressing the photo <laughs> of his dad, just going, Did I do right, Daddy? This is just so bad to control. I cannot, I cannot even get across to you guys. It looks worse than it feels. How? No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. It is so heavy. minutes <laughs> more than enough yeah so this series is cheese as fuck but it's never as bad as everything around that Mundus boss fight it, it everything around that Mundus boss fight is laughable it's hilarious <laughs> like the fact that it became what it became on the merits of gameplay alone, yeah. after this is like fucking and like that that, that, that was one of and then you get to the end. It's a little music box. It's like oh, it's so sad that because mommy and my brother and my dad, everybody dead, all of them, everybody fucking dead. I'm alone, and they'll never ever come back ever. And also, by the way, the game does not kick you back to the main menu. It just loops you immediately says, into hard mode. Hey, fucker! <laughs> go to the hard go mode. Go to hard mode now. <laughs> you, you start with everything. You even start yeah. with Bangle of Time, which is kind of ridiculous. It is aggressive in its fucking forcing you into the next mode, like just to let you know, like you're not done yet. So there, we did Devil May Cry one. <laughs> All done. <laughs> Well, fuck, fuck that's awkward. <laughs> that's awkward. That's the that's your fucking collection for you. <sighs> All right. Well, we've done everything that we need to do. Here. You know. You know. I mean, quite frankly, I feel like we. I never thought this day would come. That we just get around to God Hand and then Devil May Cry and um. We totally did do God Hand. I fucking. Yeah, we're we're just recently pulling out all the stops. Why don't we just keep going?
Give it. Carl's